All right, Chrissy, thank you. Chucky is back, season three, part two, but for how long? Jennifer Tilly and Devin, or should I say Mr. President, joining us live from Los, Ange Los Angeles this morning. Ooh, that look, that look. Hi, Shelly, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Great, thank you. you they, they said the word It's Chuck always a good day when we don't have to deal with Chucky. Yeah. I'm happy to be here with Devin because if Chucky was here, he'd monopolize the, con monopolize the conversation. You, you know what, you're absolutely right because I just say the word Chucky and I just want to like get under my, my desk. I don't even want to be in, I don't want to be here. I just don't want to be here. That's totally where he would be hiding now. Yes. <laughs> Are you serious? Are you serious? No, like seriously, I have a th I remember growing up and like, one eye open watching little clips of it and it really frightened me after all these years i'm the same way so many people have said to me that they were terrified by chucky when they were little my, my boyfriend actually gathered together all his sister's dolls removed the heads from the dolls put them all in a sack to take down to the dump and luckily he was intercepted by his mom who said you know he had nothing to worry about from his sister's dolls but so many people are frightened of chucky um wait wait he took all the heads <laughs> off the dolls put them in a bag down to the dump, and, that, and, and you're worried about the doll <laughs> I'm glad two, you two said separate, something. Two separate I was, bags. I was thinking the same thing. I'm glad you said something. Wrong person to be worried about, right? Like, well, well, the thing is with myself, I play Tiffany and Chucky's my boyfriend, so I don't find Chucky scary at all. I find him adorable. I think he's so cute. And Chucky is funny. Like, people love Chucky. They're not. It seems like now people are less scared of him because they grew up with him, mm. and they're more interested to see what he's going to do next. This is a scene where I'm in jail. Do we have a shot at Chucky, what he looks like nowadays? Is there, is there, was there a shot coming up? I think it's coming up. Coming You're wondering up? why Tiffany is dressed like that in yeah, jail? Yeah. She voodooed the guards so they bring her sparkly things to cheer her up. Oh. Uh, she's on death row, by the way. That's why she's depressed. Being on death row can depress anybody. I... Now she's talking to Chucky on the phone. She's trying to encourage him he's depressed because he looks... Wait. Horrible because somebody oh, put a voodoo oh, spell oh, on him. There he is. There he is. He's dying of old age. What an ignominious end for the killer doll. I like. I really don't. Yeah. Know she's if I telling want to him, get a hold of the new the nuclear codes. You're in the White House. Get a hold of the nuclear codes and blow up the whole world while you're at it. You know, there's nothing like a little encouragement for yeah, your man. I mean, what a story, Devin Idlehands Final Destination. Uh, do you like horror stuff? Like, is that really stuff that brings you? Joy? I didn't know how much I liked it till I was about. For, I've always been watching since a, since a young boy. I'd, I'd rent whatever was crazy in the video store. The the guy the the guy that owned the video store would let me rent whatever I wanted as long as it wasn't behind that curtain. Um, <laughs> and I would rent whatever. And then when I was eighteen, I did Idle Hands, and I just realized how much I love doing horror films. And so I always kind of come back to it. Um, you know, whether it's uh, um, Chucky or Hunter Hunter or Final Destination or Idle Hands or whatever else along the way. Um, it's just it's something i love to do and i probably will continue to do hopefully we do four five six seven eight uh more chucky yeah. seasons um well i think we will we're getting amazing reviews we're 100 percent on the tomato meter that dreaded tomato meter but the critics seem to love us devin in this show plays the president of the united states every season he plays a different character that gets killed terribly oh. we, we're keeping our fingers crossed for the president because he's kind of a likable guy and he has kids i'm not dying this year oh, yeah it'd be really rude it'd be really rude to kill the president i think no, and yeah, unpatriotic if I was in Vegas, I wouldn't put any money on me dying this year. Oh, uh, okay. Tell us more. What else is going to happen? Can you tell us anything more? Well, I'm going to say we have a chance of being in the Guinness Book of World Records for the most amount of blood ever used on a television show. So in season three and a half, you can expect lots and lots and lots of blood. Yeah. Uh, Devin, actually, he was in a scene where uh, he was uh, accosted by a lot of blood, assaulted, I might say. Yeah, I, I, was, I had to deal with so much blood that the next day uh, I had to go to the doctors to get my ear flushed out. Uh, uh, that's how much blood we were. I was just soaked in it all day long, oh, just mm -hmm. pools of blood. Um, but I had a, I had a great time. 
It was a lot of fun. And Tiffany is on death row, so she's going to die with lethal ejection, but she has a fabulous outfit to die in. So, you know, stay tuned. We're weird people. I, well, yes, we're you know, weird you people. You said it, not me. And I know you're not weird people, um, uh -huh. but, you know, we're just all different. I just like the kissy, kissy, huggy, huggy kind of movies. Uh, you know, it's just not my thing. To There's some of that. There is. <laughs> I kissed them in, in season one. one. It's one of the highlights of my acting career. <laughs> <laughs> okay, maybe one of these days I'll watch it. Maybe, maybe. But I know a lot of people are watching it because it's a huge hit. We appreciate you talking to us here in San Diego.